The day zero phase refers to the set of tasks that need to be performed to make infrastructure available for applications. Depending on the complexity of the infrastructure, the available technical skill set and the sophistication of tools, the day zero phase can take days or weeks. In many scenarios, manual intervention and significant technical expertise may be required. This can make reconfiguring the infrastructure down the road a daunting task. Infrastructure admins can use RAFE to standardize and perform all day zero tasks quickly and efficiently. RAFE automates repetitive and manual tasks, improving repeatability and eliminating variability. RAFE makes it faster and easier to stand up new infrastructure, allowing customers to launch applications faster and drive overall business value. Infrastructure admins use the RAFE's Ops Console to quickly provision and manage the required infrastructure for their containerized applications. RAFE provides guided workflows that help provision clusters and necessary infrastructure from scratch on heterogeneous infrastructure spanning bare metal, virtual machines, and public clouds. Admins can also programmatically create and manage clusters using RAFE's REST APIs. In addition to multi-node, high availability cluster form factors, RAFE also supports a single node, non-HA cluster that can be used for low utilization regions or non-production use cases. Once the necessary infrastructure has been provisioned, admins also have the responsibility for ongoing management and health of the infrastructure. Admins can use the RAFE Ops Console for tasks associated with ongoing management of the provisioned infrastructure. For example, an admin can review utilization trend data for capacity management and planning purposes. The administrator can also decommission infrastructure that is no longer required. 